There's just a bug in the studio. Yeah, somebody get that. I want to munch bugs. I want to munch. Squad. First off, it was dead to me on Netflix. (laughs) Cool. Cool. I'll just say cool back. (laughs) Um, Oh, okay. (laughs) I don't know. I, okay. So this is a weird situation where I heard about this when it was first making the rounds. And I, it was like such a munch squad that I has somehow assumed that it had be like, I had already done it. Like once I'd heard about it, it just seemed like, oh, certainly I, I've already done this. Right. Certainly I've already done this. Um, but that I I haven't. And so it's Garfield Eats. <laughs> uh-huh. This is Is this the concept of the orange cat we all love? The orange cat is in it. And it's He's just the concept it. that he does consume food for calories and power. Yes. He's in it. He's in this one, okay? And it's Garfield Eats. Introducing, it says here in the subject line, the world's first Garfield mobile app restaurant. Wait, what is that? Love me, feed me at Garfield Eats. It's the world's first Garfield mobile app restaurant. So that means that when they decided to do it, they had to see... Has anybody else done a Garfield mobile app restaurant? I can't believe and they the answer is no. Rush. I know. They were the first ones to pioneer this did, at Garfield Eats. Did you say love me, feed me? Love me, feed me mm. at Garfield Eats. Does it say that? It's still the, sub, it's the subject of the, it's the headline of the press release. The headline of the press release says, like Frankenstein <laughs> would say, love me, feed me, Frankenstein Eats. Or like Audrey 2 from Little Shop of Horrors might Another say. option. Uh, you all are getting, it's not that you can't see the forest for the trees. There's like a big sign outside that's like trees ahead and you stopped there. Okay. Like you need to come with me, okay? Garfield is, this is how this press release fucking starts, okay? Garfield is the most read comic strip in the world. You know that Garfield eats. <laughs> Holy shit. I what? do know that's that. That's the first Garfield is the most read comic strip in the world. M Dash, you know that Garfield eats. I remember that a about lot. him. A lot. Oh. That's a whole sentence. A lot. The fabulous, funny that inspired the what? Certainly they meant to say feline. Certainly they meant to say feline, but they don't. They say the fabulous, funny that inspired books, <laughs> <laughs> movies, and TV wow. shows. Feed the fabulous, about funny. To mo- Love him. <laughs> the fabulous funny is about to mark uh, its fortieth year. This sounds like how John refers to Garfield if they were like old Victorian lovers. Oh my fabulous funny! Uh, <laughs> this it's about to mark his fortieth year on the comics pages. So it's apropos that Garfield eats a new innovative mobile app for entertainment and ordering food will make its debut in the world. What the fuck do you think apropos means? <laughs> What do you think <laughs> apropos means that 40 years of Garfield being on comic pages is apropos to do a whole restaurant about it? Garfield Eats is a new food experience brought to you by the world's first intergaging what? app. Stop. What? 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 Stop. You're the Garfield <laughs> restaurant. You don't get to make up that word. That also, once again, sounds like some of the most steampunk shit I've ever heard. <laughs> It is gonna. We fucking... must apply force to the intergauge if we want to power our steam I zeppelin. Want, I don't want to do anything else other than this press release. This is the the first sentence of the second paragraph of this six paragraph long press release. It's the world's first intergauging app, mm. 
and it is an entertaining and engaging mm-hmm. app. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's Fuck. A, it, it's a. Off. It is a. It's entertaining and engaging. It's both entertaining. This is entertaining me, but not engaging me. It's an entertaining and engaging app that replaces the quick service restaurant with the quick mobile restaurant. Oh. Okay. Not a QSR, a QMR. The app immerses the user in a complete Garfield experience. Holy wait. How much longer do we have in this episode? Because I'm starting to feel like this may be it. Now, Justin, before you continue uh, on with any details, they're just kind of Oh, I'd love to take a break, Trev. Let me hold on, let me pull over the car. They're, okay. they're just throwing out that word complete with a lot of bravado, huh? Because to me, yeah. a complete Garfield experience does involve like a costume and maybe a giant house that makes me feel like the perspective of a tiny kitty. Maybe even a box of dirt I'm supposed to shit in. Yeah. Unless I can experience this app through the Oculus Rift, mm-hmm. I don't think this is a complete Garfield experience. I'd love that to be true, but I don't I don't think that that's accurate. It's a quick mobile restaurant. The app immerses the user in a complete Garfield experience, offering cartoons and augmented reality. Holy shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Cartoons and augmented reality and food. (laughs) Because it's a restaurant. (laughs) one remember how it's a restaurant yeah because it still is <laughs> and it's got that too because it's intergaging yeah garfield eats by the way is stylized no space eats is all caps so that's powerful fucking cool it's very fucking cool it's like a it's a very punk rock of spelling garfield eats um so <clears throat> uh on the menu delicious healthy Farm to plate, and here they have in parentheses F2P. Uh-huh, <laughs> this uh-huh. is a free to play AR Garfield <laughs> experience. <laughs> you can fucking have this this fucking fresh kale that just came from a half mile away while you put on your Google Glass and have Odie's big powerful feet step on and crush you, baby. Now we um, should warn you there are micro transactions. I didn't even finish the. Let me finish the clause on the menu. Delicious, healthy, farm to plate lasagna, of course, and pizza, shaped like Garfield, what? and baked in a wood fire oven. Off, uh, ordered through the app and delivered quickly to anyone in Dubai. <laughs> oh, Justin, you just—I have never been so quickly deflated. I know, I know. I can't fucking believe you. What you just did, what I, you just did was treasonous. <laughs> it was treason. Order through the app it is delivered quickly to anyone in Dubai. Also, this is a sentence. Also, because Garfield loves his coffee, enter the Garfuccino. <laughs> made with 100% Arabica coffee from Italy. It's an international affair. The the word Garfuccino is the grossest <laughs> thing I've ever heard. Like, if you told me that was a euphemism for vomit, I would be like, oh, man, I got to go Garf. I have I'm a Garfuccino all over this place. I've got a running list of substances I would least like to drown in. And Garfuccino has just <laughs> rocketed up the list. Especially when you consider that one of my favorite, like, uh, abomination words, Dunkachino, is such a great word that I love saying. Yeah, they were so close. Garfield Eats co-founders. Oh, no. uh, Are they okay? No, man. That's too bad. (laughs) Sorry. Garfield Eats co-founders Nathan Mosery and Pascal Heider were born well after Garfield's rise to fame, but both were fans of the cartoon growing up. What the fuck could that possibly matter? <laughs> Knowing Garfield, so they're legit. For Italian- These aren't your bandwagon Garfield. Oh, we, no, they know they're going to get the brand right. Knowing Garfield's penchant for Italian food, they thought Garfield would be the perfect pitch man for their brand of scooter pizza. I guess. <laughs> yeah, I don't know that he's a fan of Italian. We never see like, we never he's see lasagna. scenes of him like at a fancy restaurant enjoying like 
a, a like bolognese or something. Like he, you're gonna let, you're gonna lose this because his favorite food's lasagna. All right, you're gonna lose. No, this. I know that, but his favorite food's lasagna. That doesn't mean like he's a fan of a type. It just means he really likes lasagna. Yeah. Their vision is to make the ordering of food fun and easy, utilizing modern technology. You can use voice recognition to order. Here's the thing. How frequently do you have to order from the Garfield Eats app before you're like, I don't have to time to type this every time I want lasagna? I'm going to need to start speaking and just rolling the if dice. If I could have a button like one might get from Amazon, then I would have right. that ju- with just a picture of a Garfield-shaped pizza on it that I could push. No, I, you, no, I sold my phone. I got an Amazon Dash button for Garfield pizza. And you know what, scooter pizza. what really sucks about that is when I'm watching my, my, my television stories... And one of the characters on the show says, boy, I'd love to have a scooter deliver me a Garfield-shaped pizza in Dubai, which happens in most of my shows. Yeah, it's gonna send that's, that's what false... happens eight times in Baller's episode four. That's a false positive. That sucks. And I, maybe I don't want to go. Of course, I am always going to want a Garfield-shaped pizza. That shit's hilarious. Yeah, uh, by the Garfield... way, if you're wondering, I looked it up. Garfield-shaped pizza is like the, the outline of his face, which looks to be an impossible shape to roll a pizza out into. So mm. every one of these motherfuckers must be like hand shaped into yeah. his face. Nice. Uh, um. So, uh. okay, so Garfield Eats will adhere to, and I'm sure this was everyone's concern, uh, adhere to strict F2P guidelines mm. on supply sourcing, guaranteeing no GMOs, <laughs> that doesn't matter. Uh, no preservatives, no That's artificial That's Garfield colors. modified organisms. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, he hasn't, he hasn't fucking licked anything. Uh, no, artificial, no, no artificial colors and no fertilizers. I mean, I should hope not. That would be a weird topping as these things go. <laughs> They'll also use rechargeable electric scooters to deliver the food in rebox packaging that can be repurposed. Okay. Anything can be repurposed. What's the Venn diagram? Of people out there who are so excited about, like, is there, is there, how big is the overlap between, like, yes, listen, of course, of course I want to eat a Garfield shaped pizza or maybe even Garfield shaped lasagna. I'm not sure, but only if it is sustainably sourced and eco friendly. Farm Otherwise, to table. Yeah. F2P. Free to play. Um, no loot boxes. No pay to win. Here's something that's just a whole. There, you guys know what a nut graph is? Sure, Griffin, you probably know that from journalism. Right. Well, there's a nut graph. It's the paragraph testicles. in a press release that's so good that you can't not have a cum. <laughs> now, a nut nut graph is a thing that you like. If you're a reporter, you like save. It's like anytime you need to talk about this thing, like you can put this in and nut right anyway. there. So the nut graph for Garfield, and this is a paragraph that I'm assuming is in everything Garfield related. From here to eternity. Nearly 40 years ago, on June 19th, 1978, Garfield was born under the comics pages. The mastermind of cartoonist Jim Davis, that's not what that means. Garfield no, or, is a humorous or, wait, strip. Let's entertain the possibility. <laughs> wait, <laughs> Jim, Jim Davis not Jim, exist? Jim Davis was the fictional creation of the orange lasagna cat Garfield. <laughs> Whoa. Garfield is a humorous strip. And you know what? Humorous is just about right, huh? That really get it doesn't say riotous or funny. No, it's humorous. <laughs> it says it's humorous. It's definitely not sad most of the time. <laughs> it's this un, this unsad strip, <laughs> except sometimes it is very sad. Though I will most say that of the it is time. very sad. Garfield is a humorous strip centered on the lives of a lazy, cynical orange cat who loves lasagna, <laughs> pizza, coffee, and his remote control. His owner, the long-suffering John Arbuckle. <laughs> And Odie, a sweet but dumb dog. <laughs> so, it, can you? Okay, but here's the thing, Travis. Here's the thing. This is five this paragraphs, five in. paragraphs <laughs> in. This person I'm like, excited about this idea. I cannot is... wait to find out who this Garfield character is. Right. Who the fuck is Garfield? <laughs> <laughs> this is so good. I love all of it. F2P lasagna for sure. <laughs> who the fuck is Garfield? I cannot wait to find out about this lasagna cat. <laughs> about who Garfield is. That's the one thing. Oh my, God, my checkbook is out. I'm loving it. But who's Garfield? 
<laughs> it gets it actually ends on an even higher note. Garfield's creator, Jim Davis, said he was delighted with the concept. Here's a quote. In 40 years, no one has ever come to me with a better thought out plan to deliver great food in a fun Holy and engaging shit. way. Holy shit. Really? <laughs> so Jim Davis, in Jim Davis's life, one component of it is people frequently come to him with plans to deliver great food in a fun and engaging way. No, no, oh, no, none of he you. He can't even look at his Twitter DMs anymore. It's just fucking So here's the thing, Jim. It's called the Gar Ferrari. No. And it's a Garfield shaped Ferrari, and you bring in kids love Listen, it. Listen, when I created Garfield like a half a century ago, I did so with the dream of one day turning it into an F2P home delivery food intergaging experience and you have not found it yet sir so you this take this garbage my and you bury it in a box of dirt where it belongs so you can go to garfieldeats.com and and find out uh more about that i'm very disappointed because i wanted to get the garfield eats app on my phone i think it's only in the uae but if you search garfield on the app store here's what you get garfield rush garfield uh, my big fat diet, my talking Garfield, Garfield survival of the fattest, Garfield snack time, Garfield go, Garfield food truck, Garfield daily, and Garfield walk. This is all the Garfield apps that there are. So there's a lot of those. Wowsy bowsies, my boy. Something? This website, GarfieldEats.com, is a good one of the websites. <laughs> this website, Justin, I would, yeah. this website, it's a good website. In this website, You've seen lots of websites, folks, because the internet's been around for a bit. And this website, they do have a picture, and it's half just Garfield's face, but then the other half is what looks like an asparagus and broccoli pizza. So it's almost like he yes. is a, I'm going to say Pizza Morph, which is a new series from Scholastic that I'm very excited about, in which famous cartoon cats do turn into pizza. This website is so fucking good, Justin, I'm losing my mind. It's I think very, it, we've been looking, we've talked uh, behind the scenes a lot about trying to find that perfect excuse to do a Dubai live show. And maybe this is it. Maybe this is, maybe we, it's not, we don't go to the live show and happen to eat some Garfield shaped pizza. We go eat some Garfield shaped pizza and happen to do a Dubai live show. <laughs> there is on the website. No, because they did it in Canada too. It is in Canada, so it is. Well, we're never going to Canada. Let's let's admit that. (laughs) Canada. What's that? There's a there's a video, um, on the website that has 371 views. It was released May second, so this is off the presses. It is on the Garfield Eats website and is a three minute and 44 second long video of Jim Davis talking about. Garfield eating while he holds a stuffed Garfield Fuck and yes. cartoons of Garfield yes. play behind. Wow. That's a video that you can go see at GarfieldEats.com if you want to scoop that up. Griffin, if you want to, um, if you could edit in like 10 seconds of the audio from that, I think we'd be cleared to it uh, just to like get a little bit of that heat. Okay, don't tell Jim. Garfield Eats. I think that's been pretty well established. His lifelong love affair with pasta and pizza is legendary. In fact, if Garfield could dream up the perfect restaurant, it would feature lasagna and pizza. Well, Garfield's dream has come true, and it's in the form of a new innovative concept restaurant. Take care of the cat, and the cat will take care of you. And I'm on the website now. There is a little chat box where you do want to talk to customer service. So I did ping them, hoping to ask, like, are you planning to spread to the States anytime soon? So I said, hello. And then the, the bot responded, oh, it's you. Thanks for chatting us up. One of our friends will be, one of your friends will be happy to reply to you in a few seconds. Give us your name and number. We'll call you back. And then I panicked. I, uh, hard pass. I panicked. I said, my name's Derek. And then customer service immediately responded, we are experiencing large volumes of chat messages. I'm sure, yeah. Please leave your mobile sure. number or find our social media page called Garfield Eats app for updates, offers, and more. Call us anytime by clicking the call us icon. For every order, you will get free pause to unlock. <laughs> Guys, you will get yeah. free pause to unlock coupons. What? And Garfield exclusive series. I don't series. think you meant to do that. I don't think you meant to do that. Guys, I don't think this is Groupons misspelled because why would they give out Groupons? I think this is Garfield 
coupons is an experience that they have a currency that they have titled coupons. <sighs> there is a fucking okay, guys. This is gonna sound like a joke, but it's not a joke. So this rebox thing, you can um, and not it's not rebox how it sounds in your brain when I say the words. It's R E hyphen. B O X right Rebox is a thing where you can reuse right the packaging that your food comes in, and they have videos for how to do it, um, uh, on the website. And there's a video that is 20 seconds long that says how to transform your Garfield cup, your Garfield eats cup into a pencil holder. Wow! And here are the yes. instructions. The instructions are this: number one, use this as a pencil holder. That's, oh, that's it. Oh, boy. That's it. Oh, boy. That's it. You've made me very happy, Garfield Eats. Thank you, Garfield Eats. Please come to West Virginia. I will start a fucking... I will start a, a branch here. I will buy a scooter. I will just... You can franchise here. Please. Please, I'll do anything. <laughs>